Hi guys, hope you're well. I just wanted to take a moment to shed some light on the energy of the planet right now, which is becoming so intense that it is completely throwing the whole population into division, chaos, confusion, and in some cases, anarchy. So this is in regards to the recent events that are taking place in uh, terms of the death of George Floyd, the staged riots that took place as a result, and the division that's being caused through the mainstream media. So there are a lot of things that we are just brushing under the carpet and not looking at. And on a connect collective level, there is a level of cognitive dissonance going on where we are not connecting the dots and we are being played by our emotions. So I just wanted to take a greater look at the energy aspect of, of what's causing all of these divisions and confusions and how we are being played and manipulated. So if we look at the whole planet right now uh, on an energy scale, there, the, the 5D gamma wave radiation that is coming into our atmosphere is amplifying day by day, minute by minute. And this is the main contributing factor to such a dichotomy of so many polarized opposing views about the coming up elections, about the uh, staged riots, about this uh, pandemic that was completely like uh, massacred on a massive scale. And so much truth has officially come out. But all at the same time, people are not interested in looking at the evidence. The people are just moving on to the next story without even paying attention to anchor themselves in the reality and learn more about the facts and to be able to uh, use their reasoning mind instead of jumping through hoops of a, a ringmaster that is just giving us the narrative that we need to play by. So people, we need to wake up. We need to understand that it's not about um, going at each other's throats and sp uh, spitting hate each at each other. That is never the intention. The intention is always to wake up. The intention is always for us to put on our thinking hats, stop calling at each other names, and to begin to dig deep and do our own research. That is the most critical thing that is missing right now, is that um, we are being so duped by this whole charade of the mainstream media, which all of which, all mainstream media, all news companies uh, are owned by the same um, by the same bankers, by the same cabal, by the same Illuminati who control our planet. These are the people we pay our taxes to and they in turn are imposing so many restrictions, so many illogical um, um, rules and laying out the gr groundwork to control us at a more and more minute uh, level, taking away our rights and freedoms over false narratives. So these are all the things that we're completely missing over. There are so many things that are happening in the background and people are not even talking about those. And I will go in depth into those events and how they're being staged and how they're being completely hidden. This um, current narrative of the riot is uh, being played out exactly for the purpose of creating division because when there's chaos, negativity, and division, that is what feeds the Illuminati, the reptilian race that is, um, that is trying to gasp for the last breath. And if we don't give them the energetic fodder of our negative energy, of our divisiveness, of we, by allowing us to be divided and ruled and conquered, that's how they feed off of us. And they've been doing such a good job at it for thousands of years. There's, they are expert chess players at this point. And these events are being orchestrated for humanity to wake up. So we really need to get back to the basics. We need to understand that it's not anything that is creating division is automatically you need to look at it and say, okay, that's not for the highest good. What is the agenda behind this? Start asking the right questions. And um, I hope that um, over the ne next series of uh, events, the way things roll out, people start to um, become a lot smarter by asking the right questions at least. That would be a good place to start. And then by uniting 
and realizing that all of us are on the same team. We're just being divided so that we can be easily ruled over. So this is not about racism. This is not about black versus white. This is not about Democrats versus the Republicans. This is not about wearing a mask and not wearing a mask. It is about creating as much division as possible. And literally, if you look at things energetically, the reason I say this is laughable is because energetically, the mainstream media is being used as a ringmaster. So imagine all of Earth being a circus and the ringmaster is simply uh, holding a ring of fire, making the lion uh, jump through hoops. And collectively, we are the lion because the, the day the lion wakes up and roars, the ringmaster is done. But we give so much power to the mainstream media, we jump through all the hoops they create for us. They say jump, we jump. They say sit, we sit. They say riot, we riot. They say put on, stay at home, put on a mask, we do that. We are playing to their tunes, my friends. So it's time to get a lot smarter. It's time to get a lot wiser. It's time to open up our third eyes. And it's time to uh, embrace humanity as our own brothers and sisters. We are one united family, whether you admit it today or not, whether you like to be divided and foster in hatred and negativity and spewing out all these negative comments, which is just going to delay the inevitable. It's just going to make it so much more difficult. It's already a hot summer. It's already going to be such an intense month of June with three uh, eclipses that are coming. So much gamma wave radiation is exploding into our atmosphere, causing our, us to wake up. But we have to realize that sometimes these levels of intensity of energy drive people insane. And uh, that's what I'm seeing right now. I'm seeing collective insanity. I'm, um, I'm sharing messages out of my love for everyone, out of my love for humanity. And the last thing I want to see is for these messages to be used to create further division. That is never the intention. So I wanted to come, jump on here and clarify all of this and let everyone wake up and unite and harmonize and get our game plan together so we understand what's going on on a wider scale. Thank you for tuning in. I love you guys.